Hey, McDowan here. Today we are taking a look at a brand new Fortnite 4 inch Supply Llama from Jazzwares. This is what it looks like on this side. We flip it around and there's the weird creepy bone llama on this side. It's This is a really kind of a weird and interesting package. This has been redesigned. This is not the old loot llamas or the llama drama loot pinata. Uh, down here it says there are 15 pieces and down here a little bit lower it shows everything that's in it. This is the version that has kit and the figure can transform. We'll get to the figure when we get to it but let's get this uh, box, let's get the stuff out of the box and take a look at everything. If you're new to the channel, welcome, and please subscribe so you'll be notified of future videos. If you want to help the channel out and you play Fortnite, please feel free to add my creator code to your Epic account. It's McDowan. So I discovered something while I was opening it, and I do have it open, and I got all the stuff out of it, but I thought I'd show this to you really quick. This is a false left side. It's just like the vending machine that when you open it up and you take the plastic off you can pull this piece off this has got all that information nothing back here but you are greeted with another one and to get into this you have to go in here through the rib cage kind of get in there to the guts I guess is what this is is you you open this up and you just pull it out now there's supposed to be according to this a meow let's see a meowabunga spray sticker so like the others there's a sticker in here but it's not right in here and also the llama has no confetti so we're done with the confetti it looks like we're just gonna set this off and get to the opening of this stuff right here so as I mentioned before there are 15 pieces including a sticker and the sticker is not included inside it's actually gonna be one of these I counted all these and there are 15 bags so let's just get to opening these things up and take a look at what's what and I'm gonna do the old-fashioned way of ripping this thing open Ooh, okay the first thing we've got is a quad launcher cool quad launcher next we're going to grab this one and open this one up this may be the sticker <laughs> makes me think of the old days when we'd go and you'd put some quarters in a machine and push it up and it would shoot out a sticker at you this must be the meowabunga spray sticker cool it's a little bent there that's a cool i like that so what you can do because this does not include building materials with a printed on spray anymore they've removed those four pieces so you could put this on your laptop you could put it on a binder you could put it on a spray or um, a set of building materials if you wanted to and just have fun with it get that off to the side all right let's open this one right here and we've got a crossbow cool we've seen that before got a little pink and white on the end otherwise it is this yellowish gold all right next is hey <laughs> uh, there we go the feline fun back bling this will and it's already having lots of fun this goes with meow souls who we will be getting in the mail very very soon any day now actually meow souls ghost and shadow comes with the agents room the new agents room very cool next is i think they made these a little bit easier to open up hey cool this is a proximity grenade launcher and guess who this goes with this i think actually this doesn't really go with anybody but it looks like i know let's give it to kit because kit has is it a shockwave grenade maybe it's not a proximity grenade maybe it's a shockwave grenade but this might look cool with kit i like the little uh the little uh paints right down the side and the blue parts that's neat this is definitely a new uh grenade launcher than what we've gotten before next hey is this the fusion orb the fusion orb back bling it's definitely translucent right there look into my eyes i will tell your future anyway rub the, rub the globe for luck right i think that's the fusion orb very nice <laughs> it sticks out just a little bit what's right here in front of me 
Gonna have to get rid of all this trash. I'm gonna lose track of what I've opened. Hey, it's a light machine gun. A light machine gun. We've definitely see this, seen this before, but I think it has a bit more of a shine to the blue paint. But light machine gun, very nice. Let's see, what have I opened? Let's scoot some stuff. Uh, this doesn't seem to be open, but it also does. Oh, it does have something in there. Hey, is this a charged shotgun? I saw part of it. It looks like a charged shotgun, and this looks to be quite possibly a new design from what we've seen before. I think we've gotten the charged shotgun, but it looked different. I'll have to take a look in my stuff. Yeah, nice looking charged shotgun. Another very thin. Oh, I finally felt it. I finally felt it. Ah, I like opening these things on camera. It's kind of fun. You get to experience the joy of opening things with me, right? Uh, this is... Oh, oh, this is the proximity grenade launcher. This is the proximity grenade launcher. So you know what that means? That means... Is this the mythic shockwave launcher? No, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I'm confused. There's a mythic shockwave launcher in here. Maybe this this is a grenade launcher. But isn't this a proximity as well? Oh, you got I've I messed some stuff up. You gotta tell me in the comment section below which ones that I mixed it up on. Maybe by the end I'll figure it out. Maybe I will figure it out by the end. Hey, I know what this is. This is a flare gun. This one's easy. Quit attaching yourself to me. This is a flare gun, and that's kinda neat looking. It's got a big orange end, big orange tip there. This is big. Whatever this is, this is big. Maybe this is a back bling. Oh, it is a back bling. Oh, oh, it's got plastic around it. They're trying to protect this really good. Ah, get off me. This goes to a figure we already have, Dark Sentinel. To the, uh, hey, I think the wings actually rotate. Uh... Actually, maybe they don't, and I'm going to leave them alone till I look at them really closely off camera, because I don't want to break something on camera. But anyway, this is the hot, the dark hot wing, dark hot wing back bling goes to Dark Sentinel, which we got in the future squad mode pack early, early 2020 before the world had some health problems, before the world had health problems, right? Anyway, I'll take a look at this later to see if it rotates. I almost don't see that it does, so I don't want to twist this thing off and break it. Uh, I'd highly recommend if you get this set, don't don't twist it either. I might put something in my community tab uh, when I figure it out. If I figure it out. Next! Living by... by uh, ah! Get, ah! This stuff is sticking to my hands. Go away. Living through my eyes here. Alright, next we have... Ooh, this is a hunting rifle, I believe. It's a purple and a brown hunting rifle. I think they've changed the design. I wonder if they I wonder if we're gonna get a whole new set of guns. There is a couple here we've seen, like the light machine gun and the crossbow, but I wonder if we're gonna get all new or uh, a bunch of new weapon designs. Because there's a lot of new stuff happening with this Fortnite line this summer. A lot of new stuff. Go away. Here we have, oh, give me a moment, what is this? Uh, heavy assault rifle, isn't it? Yep, I think this is a heavy assault rifle. <laughs> sure hope so, it looks like heavy, it looks heavy. A purple heavy assault rifle, very nice. We've seen that one before. And the last might be a back bling before we get to the main event. To the main event, go away, yeah. This, yep, there it is. This is the Uzi back bling. The Uzi back, like not U-Z-I, but O-O-Z-I-E, like ooze. Secret of the ooze, the Ninja Turtles, whatever. It almost seems like that's not quite getting into focus. It's kind of a, a strange back bling, but it also, it also doesn't look fully in focus in person. You know, this is a back bling, but you might just be able to use this as an actual gun. This actually accompanies the Summer Drift uh, character, the skin. So maybe there's a chance, there's the peg right there, maybe we'll get Summer Drift. The main event is here, and you've all patiently been waiting. At least I hope you've been patiently waiting. It is time to open up the kit 
action figure. This is the week of the cat, apparently, because just did the kit figure, uh, shadow kit, legendary series brawler figure. And now we have another cat. Wow, this looks so good. It just looks good. It looks good. <gasps> look at Kit. Oh, look at Kit. It's a cute little kitten, isn't it? Unfortunately, his head and his arms do not move like the six or the seven inch figure. <gasps> but isn't he so cute? Oh, it's a cute little kitten. Anyway, put him down here. Apparently, this cute little kitten can't stand up. Stand up, Kit. Stand up, Kit. Oh, he's got some holes right there on his feet, so he can peg into this thing here. This mech. Oh, this looks so good, too. Um, I hope it transforms. I actually don't know if it transforms. I would assume it does. If it separates, you know, it might not transform. Oh, that would be disappointing. Let's just... I don't, I'm not getting this across. You know what? I'll have to look at this, and if it does, I'll pop another video out at some point later and show you how it transforms. So anyway, let's take a look at the articulation. So unlike the 6-inch, seven 7-inch figure, I like this. This figure can can do this. The, uh, the big one can't, and it doesn't have that motion. Looks like a single... Yep, it's a single pin at the elbow. The wrist rotates, bends back and forth. Same thing on the, the right side over here. And as you could see before, race, the waist rotates. Golly, I can't talk. He cannot do the splits. This is about as far as he can go, but he can move around. I am really liking this figure. There's no thigh rotation, but like the 7-inch figure right above the knee, the leg will rotate. And there is... Okay, so there's only one pin at the knee. This is an automatic, not an automatic, this is a formed joint here, so it's the upper section that rotates back and forth, or that hinges. The lower section does not. And there is a rotation at the ankle and a hinge at the ankle. So hopefully we can get this figure to stand properly. I really like this one. I gotta say, I really, really, really like this one. This was a great, a great way. Oh, man, this is awesome. This, okay, you're going to hear me say this just might be better than the 7-inch action figure. I've got to say this just might be better. Oh, this is so cool. This is, uh, this is going into my top 10 right now. This is so cool. This is great. Oh, man, 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 look at this figure. Oh, why does he have to be in a, a llama? Why can't he be solo? Make him like, oh shoot, what is this? Uh, 15, 20, 25 bucks? I can't remember. Oh my goodness, look at Kit. It's so cool. <gasps> let's put his, let's put, the, oh my goodness, look at this. And he's easy to, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. <gasps> let's squeak a little bit here. <laughs> Oh, it's so cool. Does he have a spot? He does have a spot. Let's put uh, Meowsel's back bling on him. There we go. Kind of, now it makes him a little deep, but oh man, you can't rotate his head or any part of him to look side. Oh, I love this figure. Oh my goodness, this is a great figure. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna. Oh, dudes and dudettes, and oh, look at this. You've got to love this figure. Oh, you got to. You just got to. This is a great figure. It's so cool. It's so unique. The It looks great. Look at the, the yellows, the greens, the blues. It looks like in-game. The only thing that's missing is I wish we could transform it. But, you know, without the transformation... Without the transformation... I just... I gotta see. I gotta... I gotta... I gotta try it. Without the transformation... That's so disappointing. I was sure I saw somewhere or something. Ah, no, I can't pull that apart. Oh my goodness, it's so disappointing. <gasps> but the figure is so cool. Okay, I really got to stop. Go out and find this thing. If you don't pick up, and I haven't even seen in person the rest of what we're getting. I've seen it a lot. I've seen it all online. 
you need to get this needs to be on your list this this has got to be on your list kit is a must forget the seven inch figure this one this one beats it oh my goodness this totally beats it oh my goodness look at the cuteness i know i'm going weird on you right now but oh let's get some light over here oh snapples <laughs> dude okay i gotta quit this we've got to end this video <laughs> We gotta end this. Oh man. Oh, everyone's gotta go buy this. I'm gonna tweet this sucker. I'm gonna Facebook this sucker. You all have to go out. Go out and buy me. Buy kit. Oh, I don't even care about meowsles anymore. That's right. I don't care about meowsles anymore. I'm going to end this video. Thank you for stopping by and watching. If you found this helpful, entertaining, informative, whatever, please feel free to share this video everywhere you can, especially because, come on, this is a cuteness factor here, but share it everywhere. It really does help the channel. And, you know, hey, you know, thank you for stopping by and watching. Uh, check out whatever cool video I put in the bottom left corner. We will see you in the next video. Bye-bye!